What is up you guys? It's your girl Angie the Trap Queen. Look who's here with me. You guys are used to seeing like more of my personal life, my kids, my family, my marriage, all of that good stuff. But I'm completely changing my channel, rebranding it, and I know I've been MIA for like two years now. But first, I want to announce that your girl started a business. It is called Trap Sauce Michelada Mix. We are based here in Houston, Texas. My concept of a michelada, I have over 10 different flavors cucumber, lime, pickle, pineapple, mango, watermelon, cajun. I have so many flavors that you can mix with your beers. If you don't want beer, you can mix it with mineral water. Um, you can also add a little bit of tequila and squirt. You can mix it up. It's so versatile and it's so delicious and so refreshing. And that's what I'm gonna be sharing with you guys what trap sauce is but it's not only just the micheladas it is a brand it is a lifestyle and I can't wait to show you guys some of the footage content from all the events that we attend to concerts pop-ups and that's actually what I'm gonna take you guys on today is a day in the life with the trap queen what it's like doing a pop-up with us but I started this two years ago during a pandemic in the midst of a lockdown. I think I'm ready now to share with you guys this new side of my life. There's been a lot of a lot of ups and downs, a lot of self-development. So now I think I'm in a better headspace. I'm just excited to to share this new side of my life with y'all. If you aren't already subscribed, subscribe. Y'all already know what to do. My Haxma fam, we are now gonna call y'all the trap fam. And it's still me, it's still your girl. It's just a whole another it's just gonna be different type of content. But I still wanna share self-development tips, entrepreneur tips, you know, a day in the life of a small business owner, what it's like, the struggles, the 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 highs, the lows, all at the end. Currently on the way to go pick up the trailer. Trap sauce on wheels. There it goes. Yay! Y'all, here's my baby. So we got some of the vinyls laid down. I still got some more, some more stuff that we're doing. This is the the window, the serving window. I got all the people that I network with um, to slap stickers on. Socials right here. You guys follow us on the socials. A little outfit of the day. I got this cute black shirt from I don't know where. I got the nine right here on my hip. I got these cute jeans from Target. My purple Nikes, and yeah, some hoops. Perfect. Two chains. Did you know it's illegal to to not have two chains when hauling a trailer? Is it? Yeah. Well, all right. I don't know if it's illegal, but <laughs> I know you're not supposed to. <laughs> all right, let's go. Vamos. <laughs> One job. Good job. It's a couple hours later. We finally got to our pop up, and we have. Alea working with me today and Kelso hey, is back there hey. putting stickers and labels on our cups. So Alea wanted to show you guys how she makes her michelada. She's making me a michelada. We're gonna do a virgin one today since I'm working. So go ahead. Okay. And I need a cup. <laughs> Not so head oh that's a lot. <laughs> All right, now shake it a little bit in, oh, hold on, let me help you out here. Girl, you just overloaded this. I'm OCD, I need my space. 
clear and clean, not messy. <laughs> so add in some ice. Since we're doing soft opening, we don't have everything on the menu just yet. We still gotta add mango, sandia. <laughs> what flavor is that? Pickle. Pickle? Oh, yeah. I mean, what was it? A cucumber. Tell me what this is. Please don't stuff. drop it either. That's good. Okay. Mm. This is a virgin michelada. So instead of beer, we're using doing soda. So which toppings are you putting? Can you reach? No. Okay. This is a 100% customizable michelada made by a seven year old. Okay. All right, what else are you putting? You get to choose up to three toppings. Three. Okay. Yum. Now the sweet chamoy. Yep. Okay. You want to add what's that salt? Make sure the hole is not fully open so I don't get a mountain load of salt on my snack. So we have our regulars here, and he loves his pepino with extra limon. So I'm gonna make it the same for them. bit of the spicy sauce. Some of our chilito. Straws. Ta-da! My regular right here. You know we out here no talking about? <laughs> talking about chipping on some goddamn shizzle. You know we got that pepino, man. That's some you know what I'm saying? The best one. They're all good, but this one the best. Pepino with extra limon. Oh, again, oh. again! Oh! <laughs> <laughs> it's like, hey, I'm vlogging! What? It's for YouTube! The next day. What's up, everybody? So, I didn't get to finish the, the video from yesterday um, because we had some maintenance. Like um, the freaking tire, man. Been having issues with the tire since when we got the trailer initially. The tires were pretty low, um, but I don't know. I just I, ne I didn't think of uh, airing them up. I just thought that the trailer was ready to go. But uh, we had a flat a week ago. We patched it up, um, and everything's been good. And then yesterday we noticed we could hear it uh, deflating. So now, uh, you know, yet last night we were just. <clears throat> We were just busy uh, patching it up, airing it up, and all that. Uh, so last night we ended up just doing another fix a flat. And uh, we noticed this morning it's still low. So I'm over here on Hempstead. This is near the Spring Branch area at My Texas Tire and Wheels. So they're, they're taking care of your girl, getting us right. They have trailer tires? Yeah, he, he's selling a. Uh a used one for 50 or another one. With the same specs and everything? Uh -huh. Or one for 60. Uh huh. Esta me la voy a llevar así. Así. Entonces te dejo en 60. Ok, muchas gracias. So we've been dealing with this flat for like two weeks. I thought we fixed it. Or well, I thought <laughs> I fixed it when we ran all, all over Walmart and all these places just to try to get oh, it. Oh, yeah. Fixed. I don't I, I said it in the vlog what happened last week <laughs> running around <laughs> like what yeah happened? I spent like a good hour and a half just trying to get a tire fixed our luck it was a Sunday so you know Sundays. so what happened was last week we had an event and we pull up to the event and we noticed that we had a flat and it was on the freeway and everything but we had made it to the event by the time we noticed so anyways it was a Sunday it was five o'clock Tire shops are usually closed on Sundays, or if they do, they they end up closing at what five six. So we run to Academy, 
We ran, they didn't have it. We went to uh, Northern, Northern Tool. Tool. We called different locations. Oh we, no, tell them what happened in Northern Tool. What, we thought we got the tire. Oh, okay. So, all right. I don't know shit about tires and all of that. I just know the, the, the size, the specs, and the lug pattern is important. <laughs> And I don't know anything about, what was it called? I guess it's like the tire profile maybe, but it was like a bias tire and a ply or... Oh, sure. I don't know, there was like two different types of tires. One was cheaper, one was more expensive. So I asked for help because, you know, your girl was stuck, stranded basically with the flat. And the employee was just like, well obviously there's a difference because one's cheaper and one's more expensive. I'm like, okay, why is it cheaper and why is the other one more expensive? Like, explain to me. You know, he agreed to help us, and it was just pretty shitty customer service, like, just explain, you know, like, can I make it home, you know, and he's like, I don't know if you can make it home, I haven't even seen your trailer, and I was like, it was just crazy, but, um, anyways, we're here, we're getting done right, we are at Texas Wheels and Tires, off of Hempstead, and, uh, 34th, Kempwood, Spring Branch area, in Houston, so, they taking care of us today. Probably a little pop. <laughs> Alright, so we finally made it to our destination. We're here at the Spring Branch Pub on uh, Hammerley. And uh, so now we're ready to open this baby up. Just unstrapped our fridge and everything just freaking collapsed, which was lovely. Besides that, everything else is good to go. Kelso's hooking up the electricity and uh, ready to open. We did not film because we were pretty busy today, um, but it's the end of the night. We're about to grub, close up shop, take this baby back to the storage, and we'll see y'all in another video. Stay tuned, subscribe, follow, like this video, follow all of our socials, Trap Sauce Mix on Snapchat, Instagram, Facebook, and now YouTube. So, anyway. Deuces, see ya!